on. Uh... Talk a little bit about what's going on in this room, because I think there are some fascinating ramifications here for the future. When you introduce genetic material of research quality to a life form such as ours, which is possessed of a, a sort of, a, I hesitate to use the word, atavism, but let us say a highly aggressive nature. For example, that fellow over near the, um... I believe that's a common bat of the order Choroptera, the only mammals, I might add, capable of true flight. Ah, oh, genetic sunblock. Yes. Might I have a brief word with you? My friend, you have potential. I want to help you be all that you can be, may I? As I'm sure you're aware, sunlight poses a problem for our uh, ethnic group. We don't tin, we don't burn. Frankly, we just become a rather unappetizing sort of photochemical leftover. Thus, this formula, specially designed for those of the nocturnal persuasion, to make bright light no problem whatever. That will be of crucial usefulness where you will be going. What does he mean, where he'll be going? We can't let them get away. All they have to do is to eat three or four children and there'd be the most appalling publicity. There it is. The apple. The city's so nice they named it twice. Check it out one time, won't you? <laughs> Get away! Down! Down! Down.